Hey, it's Alicia from MobilityMastery.com, and today I want to talk to you about the number one area of fascia I would recommend to every human being on the planet if I could only recommend one thing. If everybody was forbidden from doing anything else but they could do this one thing, I would be okay with it. area of the body that might surprise you to release fascia that would be my number one pick for head to toe human health and vitality and that is the gut why any guesses if you have a guess and you want to share it in the comments below before I tell you please do I'd love to hear your guesses um, the reason is we have tons of fascia in the gut and the gut is like our second brain. Some people might call it the first brain. And when this area is restricted factually, it can not only lead to digestive issues and anxiety, but as a result of those two things and anything in here, like the organs getting impacted, right, from fascial restriction and not being as fluid and mobile and functioning like they need to, we can have a whole cascade of effects from hormone issues to chemical imbalances and mood issues, right? You feeling me? So this area packs a huge punch for feeling vital as a human being. And we have tons of fascia here, as I said. So fascia wraps every single nerve ending in the body, and we have just billions of them in the gut, right? And then fascia wraps every fibril of muscle tissue, and believe it or not, we all have a lot of muscle here, even if we can't feel it or see it. And then it wraps our organs and our bones, and for everything within the abdominal cavity to be healthy, blood needs to be flowing, you know, the organs need to be functioning, they need to be fluid and able to move, right? Our organs actually need to be able to move, um, and we need to have good digestion. If we don't have good digestion, then everything can kind of go to shit, right? So. I want to challenge all of you, especially those of you who maybe have some mood stuff or anxiety issues or struggle with depression or anything like that. Now I'm not talking about like way clinical, you know, depression, like really severe, but just the kind of usual stuff that we're all dealing with, right? Because we're super stressed out. Um, and a lot of the time it can actually be a result of something not right here. And there's something you can actually do on your own for free. You don't even need a, a mobility tool. You don't need to buy anything. And you can help yourself actually get a better gut-brain connection, improve digestion, improve organ function, and generally feel better. So that's going to be the abdominal fascia release for the gut. And I have a few videos for that. We're going to link them up in the comments below because I've already filmed them for you. I'm not gonna show you in this video, but you can click that link below and go straight to that video and watch the how-to. And I just wanna stress before you go watch that video that take whatever I'm showing you in that video and know that you can you know, extract it for any part of the abdomen. You can spend longer on this area than most other places for fascia release. So if I'm going into my abdomen, I might spend anywhere from 10, 15 minutes on the low end to up to 45 minutes, which I know sounds a little crazy, but if I'm ever struggling with period cramps or bloating and digestive issues, I'm going to spend more time here because I know it's gonna affect not only my general feeling of well-being, but my mood for sure, because when this goes, this goes. So I'd love for you to go try that and then come back and tell me how you feel because I definitely think this is one of the key areas that a lot of us could use for releasing fascia, as I said. So tell me what you think. Do you agree that this is one of the most important, if not the most important areas of fascia to release in the body? And if so, why? What's your take on that? Or what's your experience with um, abdominal fascia or releasing fascia here? Or if you've never done it before, um, what's your current mind gut brain gut connection um and do you have anything that you're struggling with here tension anxiety um, digestive issues if so comment below 
go try my video and then come back and please share with me and everyone else how you feel after doing it because people have been loving my abdominal fascia release since I released it a couple years ago and I want you to benefit from it as well. So go try it. Uh, and if you're new here, make sure to hit subscribe. And I would love for you to join my email community. I do free coaching and tell stories I don't tell anywhere else. And you can get some free resources by clicking the link below when you join. All right, I'll see you next time, guys. Bye.